Hi, I'm Dr. Morna Foy, president of the Wisconsin Technical College System. There are so many great things happening in our system. That's why I'm visiting all 16 colleges to celebrate our 300,000 students, staff, faculty, and leadership teams for everything they do to make our campuses vibrant and innovative places to learn and grow. I can't wait to go back to college. The next stop on our tour of excellence is Milwaukee Area Technical College. With campuses in downtown Milwaukee, Mequon, Oak Creek, and West Allis, MATC serves over 26,000 students. Sometimes we just connect to Scanso. We start in the Al Hervis Peak Transportation Center, where I met automotive student Ruben Guyona Jr. Even though the customer might say the horn doesn't work, we can go ahead and connect to Scanso and see that the horn does still work because we can make it turn on. So this is really dealing with everything that's electrically connected. Yeah. You want to press it? I let you press it. On. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> you didn't tell me it was going to be like that. Now that I'm fully awake, it's time for Martin Kennedy Jr. to teach me the proper technique for changing a tire. We're going to uh, use an impact wrench uh, to take the lug nuts off. And the way that we're going to take this off, we're gonna just going to go in the star pattern. So we're kind of going to go from that one to that one, you know, kind of like in star oh. formation. And so, why yeah. do you do that? Uh, just so that, uh, to make it, uh, not, not for one, not to warp the rotors in any way, and to make it so that uh, it's all like a balance. It doesn't uh, tip off on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, there you go. Perfect. <laughs> so you're a natural at this. So what do you guys want to do with this uh, when you get this uh, credential? What do you want to do oh, for work? I, I want to be a boss. You want to be a boss? Yeah. <laughs> yeah I want to be a boss. You yeah. want to be a boss? Yeah. Of course, of course. And where do you course. think you'll, you'll go right after school? Yeah, shop or a dealership. Yeah, dealership, hopefully. Dealership yeah. My mom introduced me into this. All of our family's like, uh, vehicles will, like break down a lot and stuff, so I kind of wanted to like you know, learn how to like work on them and kind of get them back on the road because we couldn't really like, you know, afford to just get a new one. So this is the time where we torque it and it has to be on the ground in order uh, for us to do it properly. What is this called? This is a torque wrench. Okay. You just got to apply some pressure. Yeah, you'll feel it. You got it. You got it. There you go. Well, very cool, you guys. Thank you oh, so much. Uh, thank you for spending some time with us yeah. and allow well, us to show you. You know, it was fun. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Got yeah. your hands dirty. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't gonna go, I ain't gonna go too crazy on you now. My next stop on campus is a game of one-on-one on one with Stormer's know. basketball player, Shelton I Williams Dryden. Boom! Oh my God, did you see that? A member of the 2023 NJCAA D2 National <laughs> Championship team. How much time do you have to spend uh, in the gym every day? A lot, a lot of time. You really gotta manage your time, school, <laughs> basketball. But in order to be good at it, you gotta... And do you, do you spend all the time Shooting or do you, are you in the weight room too and doing weight room, other conditioning? Shooting, conditioning, <laughs> conditioning here. Nice, for real, you're gonna be, you're gonna be in shape, for sure. <laughs> oh. <laughs> After hoops, I went 1v1 with Lizzie Calixo, who plays soccer and volleyball from MATC and is also heavily involved in student government on campus. That was good, that was good. Thank you for playing me. And do you think the faculty here help you figure out that balance between school and outside activities and sport, because oh. that can be really tough. Yes, yes, definitely. I definitely think that the faculty does have a lot to do with that because they help us with study halls, they help us you know, make sure that we have support. We have free counseling here, we have resources like pantries, we have student life and places that you can work here as a student. And that means a lot because as an athlete, we're dedicated to our sport, right. but we're also we're, we're becoming adults. And, right. and um, technical colleges have the biggest non-traditional um, students, that's the main um, demographic that they hit. So I think it's really, it's empowering to have support in different categories for all different types of people in different ages. See, I can't be speedy like you. I have to be crafty, <laughs> sneaky. Come on, baby, come on. Oh, did you get that on camera? <laughs> she used yes, my sir. trick. She, she used my trick against me. <laughs> yes, yes. Thank you so job. much. That was yes, awesome. Yes, that was great. Ah. Thank you. Go fast. Go fast. That was awesome. Yes. Thank you so much, Kelton. Yes.